Hey guys, in this episode of Ask the Editor, we're gonna be demonstrating an awesome technique that we've been implementing into our projects this year, a mass reveal. This technique can be used to seamlessly cut between two different clips. There's a few ways that you can achieve this technique. That's either by having a clip that's moving past an object or an object that's moving through the frame. Here's a great clip where there's a column that comes in between the camera and the subject. And this is a great object that we can use to mask a transition. Depending on the nature of the shots, you may want to put the mask on the first clip or the second clip of the mask reveal. In this case, we're going to be putting our mask on the second clip because that's the one that has the object moving through the frame. So select the clip, go over to the effects controls and go down to opacity. Under the opacity section, you're going to want to click on the pen tool. This is going to give you the ability to create a custom shaped mask. Now that you have your pen tool selected, go over to the program monitor and start creating your mask, tracing the edge of the object that's moving through the frame and also the rest of the clip that you want to show. So now you're going to want to go through frame by frame, tracking the mask over the object throughout the clip. Just hit the stopwatch next to the mask path in order to drop a keyframe. Then adjust the mask positioning frame by frame in order to match the object's movement through the shot. Premiere does have a track forward tool that you can use, but it's not always super reliable. So if you do use it, be sure to go back and correct any spots that it could be a little better. So a tip to make this look a little more realistic, you're going to want to go back under the mask and the opacity and use the mask feather. This is going to soften up the edge of the mask a little bit and it's going to make it blend a little more naturally. If you really want to sell this effect, look for two clips that have camera movement that go in the same direction. It'll make the transition look really natural. Have a cool example of how you've used the mask reveal in one of your projects? Drop a link in the comments so we can check it out. I hope this episode of Ask the Editor has been helpful for you. Keep submitting your questions to ask at arcaiscreative.com or through our website and let us know how we can help take your editing to the next level.